Morning, everybody. Ah, let's go get the girls in again. Beautiful morning today. It's a bit cloudy and overcast. It's actually quite, quite warm again. Another warm morning. So. Ah, let's go get them. It's just gone 5:30, so about five minutes late. Now there, that's annoyance. She has had mastitis in the past. That's why she's all painted up. Good girl. Stay, stay. <laughs> of course you won't go anywhere. There's meal here possibly could be eating. Morning, Dad. How are we doing? Good, good. I just so I. Ah, yes, you started without me this morning. That's the whole first try one. Oh, I'm probably pulling things up the way to the side here. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on. Hup, hup, hup. Come on, get out of it. Watch out, belly cam. Belly cam. It's actually not a bad name for it. Belly cam. Well, oh, ab cam. Oh, man. <laughs> man, <laughs> I've only had one so far this morning. Don't worry, I'll be here helping. Sorry. Come on. Nah, you've got one. Oh, no, it's not my name. I don't even know. Thank God. Thank God. Thank uh, oh, I've got a back flush coming. No. Come on. <coughs> Come on, Dallas. Like Dallas. Right up there, Dad. <laughs> And a cow push it on it. Huh? You might think, why don't we put up the chain? It's to stop cows pushing in yeah. on the other cows with their meal. And it also stops the other ones backing out. So you can have more meal on the other side. Yep, that's right. Hey, uh, your dad was trying to grab the chain and see her pushing in. Doesn't want dad to grab that chain because she wants more meal. Then they come. <laughs> Crouch. And pooped on. 
Ooh, rich guys. Hold on, hold on. Right, we had a little bit of an issue though. A little pit pump decided to back out. It's probably blocked up again with a rock or something. It happens. A little bit of hoof this time again. And I'll go and wash the can and take these cups off and see how we fix that up. No one stopped it. And a little stick. We we'll just packed under the impeller there. Yep, stopped it from moving. So start now. Working now. Lord, it'll pump it in, all it does. Truth. Awesome. Yeah. No problem. Good work, Dad. Good work. Yep, nice worker up here. Just yeah, watching, watching. Showing him how it's done. Show me how it's done. Well, he's got longer arms than me. I get short arms. Poor excuse. <laughs> right down here. Having fun? Yeah. Uh, Crocker pigs down there, remember? <laughs> mm, yummy! About half a bucket. Stones. Of just stones and junk. That'll be done every now and then. Yep, yep. Should probably be done once, uh, once a year. A couple of times. A couple of times a year, Dad's saying. So. Right. See how she goes now. Hopefully, no issues. Working a lot better now. Yeah, it's fixed it. Good work, Dad. Right, we're ready to go chop some maize. It started raining out there. It looked a bit cloudy this morning. We did this last night, so we're gonna take the round bale feeder off. We'll just chuck it just here. Not too far in the shed, nice and close there. And yeah, we'll hook up the lantern. Let's get out. Connect. We're off. Just gotta load up with some maize. Set up this height. Here you go on. Ready? Up to speed. Yep, we're up to 580. Ready? Yep. We're off. I've got the hard job. Very hard job. Yep. In front of the wagon for a start. Yep. He is looking for anything that's moving, that's right. Ah, oh, yes. He's professional, see? He's driving now. Yep. I don't need it. Me. <laughs> Their new trough too. It's not leaking over there by the look of it. Not overflowing. We've got some rain around today. Yeah. How are we doing over here? Lovely. Lovely, we're getting nice and full. Good full up. Quite full, alright. Quite full.
Purple. Yeah. Green. Brown. And brown. Three different banks. Yep. Purple is on the uh, front end loader. Go left to right. On the joystick. The yep. size green. Yep. Brown's the manual one. Yep. And brown. Brown's the best one really to use. Brown locks in. Whereas purple and green, you've got to keep moving. All right, cool. And Zash, we're going to uh, go feed out now. Dad hooked her up for us. Thank you, Dad. Let's go. We've been a pick up little dog. Gateway's a bit uh, tight, so can't get it from that way. You've only got to go over from one side. We're going to go through here. Because this paddock's basically got a real wet spot in that area there. Dad put a drain there a few years ago. Now we go down here because it's the high part up here, and we'll feed out up here. bank Come back here and open her up. <laughs> A little dance. Come on. What's up? Nice and empty. Alright, let's go see what we get up to today. Talking to Dad, and he said he wants to leave the single row chopper on while me and my brother are away, so then he can still chop by himself. He doesn't have to um, have anyone drive beside him. Can if he wants to, he'll just get um, maybe Uncle Chris to go and drive with him. But that's alright, if he doesn't want it, that's fine. Um, all good. So, yeah, me and my brother are going hunting this weekend. We're going Sunday, Saturday, Sunday Monday, and Tuesday, coming back on uh, Anzac Day. Be a good trip, great fun. So, yeah, beautiful day. It looks like it's going to be a bit of a wet day today. It's a lot of rain clouds rolling around. Interesting to see how much rain we get out of it. But, yep, so I'll help Dad in the morning load up with some maize, and then uh, he said he'll do it himself on the Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. So that's all right. Just going to lock the girls away now and. Um, See what else we get up to today. Not too sure yet. Feed our wagon off the tractor here, and look at that. Tank is here. Awesome. Let's see what we see today. 3,394 liters. Not too shabby. Got the milk solids. The milk solids. Today, there. That was uh, the day before yesterday. 3,493 liters. 357 milk solids. Four five per cow. So 145 cows, 356 milk solids. So, uh, where's that load going to? You said that load is going to baby formula. Yeah, going to baby formula up in Pocono. Cool. Get a load of baby formula. That's pretty cool. Yeah, this is 4.45. Yeah, 1.45. I need to calculate that. Let's put some water and rinse this vat because 
mà tôi đã họ ôn số thì mình đi được họ bộ đi We'll wash it to open up the paddock for tonight. He doesn't have to worry about that. Now we're going to go set up a reel for Dan for this weekend. Uh, paddock's uh, number 23. Go set up a reel. Yeah, I'm hoping the three barrels are silent for tonight. And I've got the reel on. We'll go down and set up the paddock. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Now we'll take our way back this way. There we go. Nice real setup. Let's go load up with some silage, Jerry. There's the Mr. Molly's. So I'll put a reel just around the gateway here so it's double fenced. Just to stop them from thinking of jumping through and going and seeing the ladies. Cool. Right. Now let's go find that silage. Go and hypo the shed now. We've got our XY12, which is hypo, in here with uh, three liters, and this is a 15 liter container, I'm pretty sure. Your 15 liter container, and 12 liters of water, so one, one fifth. Is it one fifth? Yeah, yeah, one fifth. And it's a uh, spray. So it'll kill all that green algae that we've got growing and even that red algae out here. There's some red algae over there. Take that out. We've got some green stuff here that'll take a few attacks, but we'll get it eventually. All right, let's get to it. Just hypo the shed there. It's already, see, I don't know if you noticed, but it's already the uh, red algae there is basically gone. A lot of that green algae there underneath the um, male feeder there, that's getting eaten up quite nicely. Hypo works well at taking out that algae, so we've hypoed the whole shed here. I'm just gonna put up about half a, half a mixture in it. Now I'm gonna do the, uh, just around the milk room here, probably, um, in our little storage room here at the front of the shed and in here just to make it nice and clean okay with that uh, that'll probably be a day for us i'll see you all milking tonight good afternoon everybody i just finished washing the vat so uh the girls are ready and look dad got me a new apron no more holes <laughs> not gonna get wet during milking now that's it we're ready, shall we? Get to milk But now, as you can see, it's actually quite a brighter color from hi fi Gives a nice, clean color, and it's not as slippery. It was quite slippery uh, before, now it's not as slippery, especially across the edges here. It used to get quite a bit slippery. Girls are coming in nicely, and look at that. Hose is going. <laughs> right, shall we carry on? For milking, oh, yeah, it is. My last milking till uh, Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, have fun though, Chris. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah, yeah. away. Right. Awesome. Oh, it's hey. But it's a start. Yeah. See you on one day of the weekend. One day of the weekend, yes. And on a Wednesday. I'm not here Tuesday either. Still coming back from the bush on Tuesday. Yeah, but you might see some updates down there. Yeah, I might put a bush one up on Tuesday. Right. See you all on uh, 
either tomorrow or Tuesday. Have a good one. More rain.